This sounds like Amityville horror, and it happened this week. A 15-year-old in the middle of the night took a gun and killed his whole family. It happened in this house in Washington State in a suburb of Seattle. The parents are deceased along with three other children who are reported to be in their teens, all just murdered. One child made it out alive, an 11-year-old girl who hid in the bathroom and then ran out the door to a neighbor's house and told them to call the police. And the neighbors had already heard the gunshots, so they were hiding the 11-year-old girl in their house and called the police. She had been shot twice, but she escaped. They have no idea what could have caused this because he had no criminal history, no issues with behavior that they knew of. The 15-year-old already has attorneys who say that he enjoys mountain biking and fishing and has no criminal history. As we know, again, he's innocent until proven guilty, but the 11-year-old sister was shot by him and kind of spilled the tea. I mean, like, she would know. When police arrived, they said there was no significant confrontation. They just easily took him in. Like, what happened there? 15-year-old just unalives his entire family, all of his siblings, his parents. The case is still developing, obviously, but this is so horrific and jarring, disturbing. Like, what happened here?